Hey guys, Xdevon here. Um, and it is another beautiful day in San Francisco. Um, so yeah, uh, we're gonna be going to work today, and we're gonna be tuning and customizing customers' vehicles. So we got my really nice tune modified Gavril Grand Marshal, I'm pretty sure. That is like cool spoiler. Then we got a side exhaust, which also has like fire exhausts, which I'm gonna show you. Then this cool hood, very aggressive hood. And I think I got a custom bumper on it. Uh, and then I'm pretty sure I also got custom wheels on it. And I also got a custom steering wheel right there, uh, which we're about to go in and see. Alright, let's quickly get a cold start here. Uh, oops, I hopped out. There we go. Also, this thing barely fits, like, just in this little part because it's really long, so I might have to start parking it on the streets. Um, so yeah, we got this custom steering wheel here, Nomi, I'm pretty sure. Um, so yeah, uh, then, um, so let's head to work. And I will see you guys there. Alright, so we are pulling up to work. Right here, where is it? Right here. This one right here. So we do rims, tires, lift kits, hydraulics. We do lots of stuff here. We customize cars. Um, where should I park my car today? I'm just gonna park it right here. Quickly do just a quick little burnout. There we go. All right, and so now let's wait for the customers to arrive. Okay, so a customer has arrived, gave us his keys to this really nice Ford Focus. Um, he already got custom paint on it, which is cool. Um, like everything else is basic. He has a basic engine, basic rims. Um, and so yeah, let's quickly take it for a spin, and then we'll get our project started on this. Let's do a quick start up. Oh, did it start? Oh, oh, it did start. All right, well, that's a kind of weird startup. Um, but we are probably going to get a new exhaust on it, this too. All right, it's front wheel drive. It sure can do some smoke. All right, let's quickly try drifting it. It's also really unusual today in San Francisco. There's almost like no people today on the roads. Yeah, this thing is very loud when you turn really hard. Yeah, this thing screeches a lot. Uh, we should probably get new tires on this, too. Um, so, alright, uh, let's get started on this thing. Alright, and so our epic transformation is complete. We went from a basic focus to this really cool epic focus. We got extra grippy tires because that we did an engine swap to a 4.6 liter V8 before it was like an I4. So um, it's very powerful engine, so we needed to get extra grippy tires. And then we used some company like Bostix Extreme for like the bumpers and skirts, and then an active arrow wing. Um, the owner told us not to really change the interior. He wanted to do it himself, and we, we're going to be providing him some parts with it as a project for himself. Um, and yeah, let's do a cold star and take it for a spin. There's also um, adjusted camber uh, and lowered suspension. All right, sounds super nice. Uh, let's try to rev it. So yeah, sounds super nice. Um, it's from a Gavril, it's a Gavril Stallion 4.6 liter V8. So it accelerates super fast. Then you got the active dyne, dyne, or whatever it is, the aerodynamic spoiler when you brake. Um, you want to be careful when you're driving this, like, near curbs or up hills, because um, the bumpers could easily break on this. Same with the camber, because, um, I mean, look at how low this thing is to the ground, and the bumpers and, like, the cam camber could definitely get messed up if you hit a curb. 
Um, but, um, it's really fast. That's for sure. Um, but yeah, uh, the, um, one problem I ran into is, uh, when, I, when the camber was out too far, um, the rear wheel, it would, like, break the rear wheels. Um, so I fixed that problem. Then you got a cool carbon fiber hood. Um, so yeah, the owner will be picking it up in a few hours. Uh, this only took, like, a few days because we had most of the parts already. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. If you go, like, up and down a hill or something, this thing, you have to be so gentle with it or else it'll, like, completely break like this. Yeah, you totally didn't just see me respawn it. Um, so yeah. The owner will be picking it up soon, and, um, they will definitely enjoy it. And, yeah, so that is it for today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, super cool car I made here. And, Xtavon out.